rather than having a module.lua, we can have a directory called module and put any.lua inside. The require function first looks for the module.lua file and if we cannot find it, then it looks for any.lua inside the directory named module. This way you can separate the modules into different sub-modules and group the related functions together. By putting another file in this directory, it becomes a sub-module. To require the sub-module, you can separate it with the dot, then Lua converts the dot to the file separator of your operating system. So on a Mac, putting dot or slash is the same thing. This is a color scheme called Night Fox. Inside the Lua directory, there are three modules, and inside the Night Fox, you have any Lua and a couple of other submodule files. You can even have any.lua inside the submodule.